No, not the T-Rex defrosting even more. That's like Mariah Carey defrosting for Christmas. Hi everyone, welcome in, welcome back to my channel. My name is Emmy. if you're new here, it's so good to have you here. Today we are watching Gravity Falls Season 1, Episode 18, Land Before Swine. Immediately, I'm excited for this episode because obviously Land Before Swine is a play on Land Before Time, which was one of my favorite movies growing up. The cartoon movie about dinosaurs, like what is there not to love about that? I feel like so many people, in my age group at least, loved that like a ton. And the combination of the fact that swine means pigs, which makes me think of my favorite character in the entire show, Waddles, our favorite pig. He is so cute and I'm obsessed with him, so I really hope this is a Waddle-centered episode, and I don't know, sounds like it could be very exciting. We're also nearing the end of season one, which blows my mind. I mean, 18 episodes is a lot, but we are really making our way through this series, and I'm really loving it. So besides that, we're just going to go ahead and get into it. If you aren't already subscribed, I'd really appreciate that. Of course, a thumbs up is appreciated too. Also on my Patreon, I'm four weeks ahead, so if you're interested in both, early access, and full uncut reactions, you can check out my link for that in the description below. All right, let's go. Focus, deputy. Remember your training. Easy, easy. Oh my god, not the maze. And they just missed someone going nearly 100 miles per hour? The time we spend together is treasure enough. Hey. Aww, they're so cute together. Reckon we should report that. Or go for a ride in our new convertible! I love that. I love the positivity. When life gets you lemons, you make a convertible. Okay, there's a dinosaur. So, I am getting Land Before Time vibes off the bat. Sure, you'll see the world famous Outhouse of Mystery. Ooh. I got stuck in there once. That is so mysterious. And up ahead if you I think that kid went to the bathroom. That's gross. Dance party? I'm not hearing a no. Yes. I want a Waddles and Mabel. Yes. This is the content I'm here for. Look at them. <laughs> I love Waddles so much. They're also really moving and grooving. Look at that pose. Paint me like one of your French girls. You're my favorite pig in the whole world. <laughs> Mine too. I don't really know any others, but he's by far my favorite. I kiss a pillow with Wendy's face drawn on it. Stop. <laughs> Dipper, do you actually? It's not my fault your pig's potentially delicious. He should be inside like a person. He should be inside like a person. Maybe we're the ones who should be put outside. Huh? Huh? Think about it. I'm on Mabel's side. I'm glad that... He doesn't have to go outside. Something hiding in these woods. Something big enough to rip the roof off a car. If we get a photo of this thing, we'll be- A dinosaur. It's the dinosaur dipper. Is sap supposed to be this sticky? Ugh. If everything goes according to plan- Ew. The creature and why were there bugs in that? I don't like that. <gasps> Did they get the picture? You! Me? <gasps> Sick of constantly dropping Cute. your baby? Yes. Ty, I'm- She's knitting Waddles a sweater. I know what you're thinking. Does it work for pigs? Oh, yeah, it does work We for were pigs, thinking that. Pig. It works for pigs, and we need that. Yeesh. Isn't knitting matching sweaters for that pig enough? Nope. Oh my god, that's so cute. I need to get my dog a matching sweater like that. That's perfect. Promise me you won't let him outside. Fine. Yeah, yeah. God, we hope he sticks to that. Because there are predators outside, including a dinosaur. The most hideous creatures known to man! <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Right, right. We, we have fun here. But they do have fun here. I'm tired. <gasps> oh, what no. <laughs> oh, no, Waddle. Sweet boy. He ate all the corn. It's not his fault. No! Come on. Don't get mad at him. How can he get mad at that little face? The creature! Watch victory, Nacho! Dude, Zeus! <gasps> we needed a dark room. Although, 
You can just redevelop it, as long as you have the film. Just ten minutes without this pig in the house. Is that so much to ask? There. No. This never happened. Oh, but... No. Keep out there. There's predators. Oh, brother. Stop. Zombies literally being taken by the dinosaur. I hate this. At least Stan saw it this time. It's kind of interesting that Stan... It's kind of interesting that Stan saw it. Because usually it's just the kids that see the mystical creatures and whatnot. This thing was a dinosaur, bro. How is it possible a dinosaur survived 65 million years? Oh, Did yeah. You see it, Mr. I never even thought about that. <laughs> I just accepted it. It took Waddle. What'd you say about Waddles? Uh, nothing. Awkward silence. Blah! At least she knit him that sweater, so there's a trail we can follow. When the uh, pig got eaten by a pterodactyl, bro. What? Not what? Seuss pronouncing the P in pterodactyl. So there I was, in the living room. Tenderly nursing him uh, with only the richest. That's what I would do. Hold him like a little baby. So I said... No See, this part of the story wasn't even necessary. Like, you didn't. It flew away too fast for you to even do anything. Ah! Oh! That really happened! Yeah, in order to make someone to believe a story, make sure you add in that really happened. Dinosaurs aren't magic, they're just big lizards! Get off my back! Oh. I guess that's a good point. But how it survived is kind of magical. <gasps> we follow that! Yeah, that's perfect. Oh. Good thing she had infinite yarn ball. Save Woggles! Waddles. Him too. Woggles? Who is Woggles? Actually, nobody knows how to pronounce it because no one was alive back in dinosaur days, so... Uh... <laughs> That's funny. As if the dinosaurs named themselves. Oh, sorry, dude. I killed that fairy. Let him down, he's... That's a lot of ways to uh, mess things up. And these rays indicate friendship. So what was Oof. it you were going to tell me again? Yeah, I don't think we could tell him now. Bros before dinos! <laughs> Bros before dinos. Why is this man always here? Is the dinosaur one of his machines? Like the Loch Ness Monster? And flew lickety split into the abandoned mines down yonder! Oh, okay. So, it stole something from him too. We're going in. Need someone to tag along and tell weird personal stories? No thanks. No. We already get too much of that sometimes with Seuss. Same piece of meat when our mouths get closed and we kiss accidentally. <sighs> you can't oh, that's interesting. <laughs> Their rope broke, so how are they going to get out? Sweet. Rose. Fancy yes. marmalade. These plants. Fancy marmalade? That's a good one to say. Is that why we saw the bug in the sap before? The summer heat must be melting them loose. Oh. I could bring people down here and turn this into some sort of theme park. Jurassic No. Sap no, I don't think that's a good idea. Maybe. We do not want any of these guys breaking free. I should have put that pig outside ages ago. Wait, what did <gasps> you just say? Wow, let it slip. Look, he's an animal. He belongs outside. No, that's it. No, he's part of the family. Pig is oh, no. Us your yarn. We just keep following and following. And when we reach the end... No. Uh -oh. <laughs> that is infuriating. Trust me. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Oh, that is it. He's like jinxed or something. He's reminding me of a character in something that literally does everything wrong. Oh, hey Arnold. There's that one kid that just has everything bad happen to him. Guys, we're making a lot of noise. Why is he standing like that? Why is the dinosaur standing like that? No, that is freaky. Well, and he dropped the lantern again, so that was short lived. I like it. And we use Zeus as a human sacrifice. I like it. What do you say? You still like it, Zeus? Wait, did you hear that? Yeah, 
Yes, I heard him. He's just in the little nest. We gotta get him. Because I can't hear anything. Oh no! Mabel, for real, you have to be careful. Shh, you're safe now. I don't think he's safe yet. Mabel, great, I got him. Now we gotta get out of here. <laughs> Good thing she bought that thing still. Huh? Uh, get off me, you dumb pig. No, Stan, you have to strap him on your belly. It must be done. <laughs> Yeah, you would enjoy this. Oh, he loves it. He loves rolling around in mud. Save them! McGucket, do you have an invention that can distract the pterodactyl? Do I? How is he just in the nest? <gasps> oh. Welcome to the world, little <laughs> <laughs> Wow, the circle of life right before our eyes. You must be hungry. I guess it's you or me, pig. Stan, stop. I don't like this. Look how cute he is. Ah, come on. Don't give me that look. What am I supposed to do? Let it eat me? Yes. Instead of models? Yes. I can live without the kid talking to me all the time. Telling me her jokes. Making me laugh. No, you can't because you love Mabel. Well, this is just about the dumbest thing I've ever done. He's wearing the strap. Let's go. Then you're gonna have to get through me, you flying devil! Come and get me! <laughs> Let's go, Stan. <laughs> He's really gonna punch it in the face? I'm okay! <laughs> oh. What are we doing? That's disturbing. A pterodactyl's eyes are so far apart that if you stand right in front of it, it can't see you. Zeus, you've been wrong about stuff? No, that one sounds factual. <laughs> God. <laughs> Oh my god. That's funny. <laughs> How are they jumping like that? Was that? He's literally on the back of it. Taming it. Well now we can have a way out too. We can fly on out of here, right? Let's go. Oh. Okay, so we can't fly out anymore. Unsure how we're gonna get out. Oh, Mr. Barnes, you're okay! Aww, she's wearing his hat. Sometimes you just gotta look out! Okay, he's alive. Maybe he still can fly us out somehow. No, not the T Rex defrosting even more. That's like Mariah Carey defrosting for Christmas. Oh, that works. Rose before dinos! Let's go, Sue. Sue's working again for us. That's kind of sappy. Oh, what? That's how I feel. No, I mean... No, oh, yeah. yeah. You've literally got your hand in sap. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a problem. A real dinosaur tooth? That's awesome. Not as awesome as you saving... He doesn't have a vest anymore. Is he never gonna wear that? Think we need to worry about the rest of those dinosaurs? I yes. Doubt it. I don't doubt it. Yeah, I do not. I ain't oh. my way through a dinosaur. Okay, Im impressive, I suppose. Actually, buys this infomercial stuff. <laughs> I know, right? Cancel the order. Cancel the order. <laughs> Me too. I had four aces. That pig is a wizard. He is amazing. <laughs> More That's numbers, and that time it's like a quote. How interesting. Friends, thank you so much for watching Gravity Falls episode 18 with me. I really loved that episode. I was scared when Waddles got kidnapped that maybe we wouldn't see him a lot. And I was like, oh, even though it's called a Waddles episode, maybe we won't be seeing him. But we did. We got to see a lot. It kind of reminded me of like the typical trope of a dad being like, we don't need another dog or a cat and then being like i don't want this dog or cat and then like being very cute with it because i feel like that was my dad growing up especially with cats he never wanted cats he used to claim that he was allergic to them and then he would like love them and like playing with them and like even making their beds and stuff like that so that was just a very very cute episode i am very worried about the dinosaurs coming back but there's a lot of things that could come back at us at once and 
it really feels like the apocalypse could happen. But yeah, thank you again so much for watching with me. And until I see you in the next video, I hope you stay hydrated, stretch your legs, please don't get arrested, and I will see you then. Goodbye.